Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Webdev. In this video, we will try to revisit the greediness and the lazy nature of this regular expression. So why I want to repeat this one again is because of that uh, regular expression, the greediness is concept is somewhat important. Because of that reason, I am trying to repeat it again. Let's try to see this one greediness thing. So if you try to see here, Let's say that I am having here a couple of numbers, something like 32, iPhone, uh, some numbers I am having, <coughs> comma, 45 hyphen, I am trying to keep it, okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, anything, or otherwise something like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, it's something like this, I will try to keep and I will have another one something like this. okay now here <clears throat> I am having a some couple of numbers here so separated by hyphen if you want to write a regular expression for this one how can we write we will try to write something like slash d should be repeated the first one with two okay so all are having minimum two so that is the reason I am having exactly two and here I am writing something like hyphen and slash d so it should be uh, it should be repeated same thing like 4 comma 6 okay then we are able to identify it <clears throat> now so this is the uh, thing which we can write it now here if you try to see if you try to see the first letter digit which is of repeat of 2 that means the first first characters is matching 2 2 and all those things now here it is taking something like digit with 4 comma 6 means minimum of 4 and maximum of 6 now due to its greedy nature regular expressions are by default greedy as i already told you due to its greedy nature what it is trying to see it is trying to search for max of for max of 6 characters so it is trying to see 1 2 3 4 5 6 it is tried, trying to see but fifth character it was comma which was not matching with the regular expression because of this reason it went back back steps okay so it, it, it went to the back and it has checked that okay so this one up to here the 4 4 is matching the 4 number minimum is matching because of the reason it has been selected now if i try to add another one okay so this is also automatically selected why because it is trying to see 4 comma 6 it will try to capture as much as it can so it is going up to 6 and on the sixth element it has found that it is not a digit then it has back stepped one step back and it has <coughs> captured the five elements okay now if you try to see the second thing in the same scenario second one and here it has captured one two three four five six six things it has been matched why because it has take, taken the maximum limit here already we are having one two three four four limits only but it has taken the maximum limit of six in the same scenario here also so that means due to its greedy nature it has took all the things let's say that i have kept a question mark here okay so then what will happen See if you kept a question mark here. Now instead of taking the six characters, the maximum <coughs> occurrences, instead of taking this maximum occurrences, it has converted into a lazy in a such a way that <coughs> it is trying to match the possible occurrences. So the minimum occurrences is trying to match. So here it is saying that okay, one, two, three, four. So now four has been reached, so it has stopped it. So now here in the same scenario, so 1, 2, 3, 4 it has been reached, it has stopped. So it will try to check the minimum possible occurrences by keeping the question mark here. So this is how the laziness nature it will have. Now let's say that, so now let's say that if I keep a another character here, for example, let's say that I am kept, I am keeping iPhone. Okay. Now let's say here, here you are having an iPhone. So this time what it is trying to do? So it is trying to take the maximum allowance here so if you try to keep my hyphen here also and if i try to keep hyphen here also now what it will try to do is first it will try to see the minimum possible occurrences that is nothing but one two three four so yeah it has occurred okay now it will check for another character and it has seen that hyphen it is there okay it has been matched it will stop this one so laziness now here it will try to check the minimum possible occurrences one two three four now it will try to check for hyphen it has found the digit 
and it knows that this is a uh, boundary between the 4 and 6 it will check that whether it is matching or not so if it is matching means okay it will take this one also into consideration and again it will check for hyphen here so if it checks for hyphen here again this one is a digit which is coming under the limit so this one also it will take into consideration now again it will try to check for the hyphen so this one has been matched it will end it for example if you have five items and if you have hyphen then also it will take first it will go for four items one two three four and it will try to check the least possible it will try to check the digits and it will try to check the hyphen thing so now it has found i uh, number so it will try to uh, it will try to see that it whether it is in the range or not if it is in the range means then okay so take it one and then again it will search for this boundary so whatever whatever the boundary it is having hyphen thing and if it doesn't find that if it finds that hyphen so it will take it will match that hyphen and it will end it so that means it is trying to take lazy nature for example if you don't have an this one <coughs> then also it will take but here if you try to see in a, if you if you try to see here when you don't have a boundary here and if you keep a question mark then it is trying to take the lazy but when you are having a boundary here automatically it is trying to take the maximum possible things whichever it is coming under the limit so this is how the laziness and the greediness will work in the regular expression so this is the thing so now without having a boundary if you have a question mark it is trying to check as less as it possible but uh, for example if you are having a boundary here again so it has shifted in a such a way that so it is trying to check the la last possible thing but if it is trying to find another one so it is trying to stop it so this is the thing so for example here if you have any word so here this one will not match why because so it has matched the least possible four okay so it is trying to fetch uh, fetch the least possible word four numbers and it is trying to match the y hyphen icon so if it is the hyphen is there then automatically this one will be satisfied so if there is no hyphen icon means so okay the entire set is not matching so then it go for the next match so this is how it will be having for example if you have hyphen here okay <clears throat> then it will match automatically so why because it is trying to see four least possible and it will try to check the icon so maximum it will try to see the possible thing so this is about the laziness and the greediness so you need to understand the important concept between the greediness and the laziness so when you have a question mark and when you have a boundary like this so when you are mentioning a boundary so after the question mark if you are having like this so then it will try to check the maximum possible thing and, uh, and not maximum possible things it will check the least possible thing and it will search for this hyphen thing so when it, it finds the uh, uh, digit and all those things it will try to count into these digits so that it should be within the limits if you don't mention this uh, question mark and all those things means it will come into a greediness nature that it will try to match the maximum possible thing so that is nothing but a sixth thing okay so this is how the laziness and greediness nature works in the regular expression hope you understood about this one if you have any doubts please post the comments below so that i will try to give the reply and also if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you